Hey friends, it's Brittany. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another part of The Sims 4 High School Years. So, um, full transparency, this might be the last episode. Um, I'm not 100% sure. I, I posted a community, uh, post. When was it? Hold on, let me check. posted it 10 days ago um and I was just wondering like since it's since the hype for high school years has kind of died down and I haven't been able to play this save because of the groundhog day bug um I mean it's fixed now but I didn't know that there was a simple fix um but I was just wondering like if y'all still wanted to see it because the hype had died down and Two people voted for yes, one voted for no. Um, so, I kind of was leaning towards not posting it again. Um, but, I think what we're going to do is just do this episode, see how it goes. See if I'm still feeling the hype for this series. And then, if not, at the end of the episode, I will let you guys know if this will be the last episode or not. So that's kind of what I'm thinking. Um, I don't even remember. Zoe. Zoe Rose. Okay. It's been so long since I've even like played with her. Okay. So I honestly, I don't remember what happened in the last episode. Did she get rejected for prom or Sydney? creeped out. Zoe didn't think Sydney was at the level of best friends yet. Maybe some space will help. I, like I said, I don't know what happened in the last part. Um, I have a, a screenshot of her asking Sydney to prom. It, uh, Zoe, why are you, s okay. But yeah, I have a screenshot of her asking him to prom, and I'm pretty sure he said no in the screenshot. But maybe... I don't know. I don't know what would have happened. And we also saw her making the prom proposal. She, I, I remember her making it in one of the parts. So I don't remember, but let's see. Um... Saturday is prom, and tomorrow we have the, um, exams, right? So, we need to make sure that she studies for that because I want her to do good. Um, okay, what's the hype on it? It's neutral, okay. So, go ahead and plant those and then go get some yogurt. Do we have any friends? <laughs> Hello? What the? Oh, that's Janae. That's Sydney's mom. Uh, let's invite Jeb over. We'll do that before we get something to eat. We could go out with him, but... I mostly just... I mostly just want to invite him over so that she can wear this outfit and then hype it with him. So let's, there you go. Let's come ask about his day or not. I hate when Sims do that. I feel like they've been doing it so much recently. Just like completely ignoring what you're telling them to do. Okay, ask about his day. Oh my God, this is really loud in my ears. Um, okay, here we go. Where's, where's the hype outfit? Let's not tell him we love him. Let's go ahead and hype our outfit, have a deep conversation. And we'll discuss interests with him. Okay, the hype is still neutral. Oh, yes. Can we hype it again for him? Hi 
prep outfit. Maybe we could ask him to prom. Okay, he, he doesn't care about our outfit. Let's go ahead and describe new idea. And then maybe we can prom. Um, let's just ask him to promise friends. Because they're not romantically involved yet. So, or yet. I say that as if they're 100%. Sure, I guess I'll go to prom with you. Hell yeah. Okay, no. What is this? Didn't read the room from fail- Oh. It looks like Zoe misjudged her audience and she managed to de-hype her presumed fly fashion choice. Sad times. Okay, well maybe Janae will- Janae will, uh, appreciate it. Let's come introduce ourselves to her. And I think that's her husband, so maybe one of them will appreciate it. Jeb, you can hang out if you want, I guess. Okay, I don't think Janae likes us. Love your name, BTW. Baby, if you're cold, maybe put your cold weather outfit on. That's just a suggestion. Why are you leaving me? Uh, discuss uncomfortable mood. I don't- Oh, she's uncomfortable. Um, oh my god, stop canceling it. We're adopting that cat. Everyone keep your peepers on the cat so we don't lose it. What? Savannah? No, stop trying to say goodbye. I'm trying to hype my goddamn outfit. Where is it? Hype outfit. Savannah. Okay, and now let's try and hype it to Savannah who's going through our trash for some reason. What are we feeling? First impressions are strong. Where's Janae? Oh. Zoe thinks Janae's pretentious and Janae thinks we're a nature maniac. Right, right. I still see Cinnamon over there. She's- the, well, I don't know if it's a girl. They're sleeping. Is it socially awkward? Oh, it's still neutral. Okay, well, remove the outfit. Let's go ahead and just sell it and go wake Cinnamon up. Let's try and sell it for 160. Okay, and then let's go wake Cinnamon up. Also, probably get out of your swimwear. Let's do a friendly introduction. Or not. Friendly introduction. Hi, Cinnamon. Oh my goodness, I love the cat. Let's go ahead and give Cinnamon a treat. Get that leaf pile just disappeared. That was so weird. Okay, and then obviously we're going to offer friendship. I know she's tired. What's this? Feeling overwhelmed. Zoe tends to get a little anxious when interacting with non-friends. Okay, retweet. Okay, let's also just like talk to Cinnamon. I wanna be your friend. Pet the kitty cat. Get to know the kitty cat. Oh, we're friends. Um. Adopt. Here we go. Guys, gals, and non-binary pals. Yes, we want to adopt the kitty. And we want to keep the name Cinnamon. Because that's such a cute name. Hi, Cinnamon. Oh, he's so cute. Okay, my game is so laggy. Um, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to pause. Is okay, Cinnamon's a girl. Perfect. Now we need kitty cat stuff. Get it a pizza box to sleep in. We're not doing that. Let's get the pink fishy bowl. And we'll get her a bed. And obviously.
obviously she's going to need a litter box. So we'll just go ahead and put that next to the trash. And then she'll need a scratching post, which we'll just pop back here. And a toy. There. Cool. So let's come fill the bowl. F fill the bowl. And then... I know you're tired, Zoe, but did you study... You did not, so we have to study for this exam. Adopting the cat was more important, I'm sorry. I don't, yeah, she, she did like over half of it, so, okay. She thinks interacting with the cat's more important too. It's good to see where your priorities are, honey. I really do need you to study though, so if you could just keep studying, that'd be pretty cool. I know you're tired. Oh, May Prescott's pregnant by dawn. Okay, baby, I know you're tired. I need you to keep studying though. You're like almost done. Oh my God, she's like not going to. Fine, I'll let you sleep, but I'm gonna have to wake you up pretty early so you can study some more. Okay, Miss Zoe, wake up. This cat has been here all night just meowing. It's a little annoying. You can literally hear her peeing. Okay, car, stop. Go away. What the? Did you just see her try and sit on nothing? And then study for your exam. Yep. What that was? You ate very fast. Did you even finish eating? You didn't. Okay, well, that's fine. Okay. Did you finish? You did. Okay. Go ahead and finish your cereal. And then go back to sleep for a little bit. <gasps> Dina would like to purchase our prom look. Okay, we'll ship that to her um, whenever we wake up. I have no idea why the time's not like going ultra speed. I thought it was because the cat was here. Not our cat, but the other one. But that cat's not here anymore. So, okay. Go ahead and wake up. We need to ship that off to Dina. Or was it Nina? I don't remember. I think it might've been Nina. Ooh, she got entrepreneur skill level two. Oh, it was Dina, Never mind. Okay, and we also need to do homework one more time for our aspiration. And we're actually almost to earning, have earned 500 simoleons. Okay, let's just solve some linear equations really quickly so it can count as her doing her homework. She also just p didn't do it, period. Well, look at that, you're late to class. Can the janitor give us detention? Probably not, right? That wouldn't make sense. Hello, I'm here. Why are you feeling flirty? Yes, okay, today is exam day. She should be good though because she did study. Okay, Sydney just decided he's not doing his. I don't know why she wants to talk or she wants to become friends with the other teacher. That's not even our teacher. Okay, let's come over here. And she needs to be friendly with a faculty member, so let's go ask about Rita's day. Hello, Miss Rita. Is that Jeb? It is. We have a romance thing with him? I don't remember seeing that yesterday. Did they flirt when I wasn't looking? I don't know. Okay, we don't need to have a conversation. I just wanted to get that done. Um, let's come deep conversation with Jeb. Let's do a new post. Post about finals, we're gonna do confident. Finals can't take me down, crushed it. Well, you still have, not us having zero followers, 
Let's do a random happy post. Lunch is truly the best part of the day. That's kind of funny because she actually is at lunch. Do we have anyone else to add in here? No, we don't. She has literally no followers. That's kind of funny. And that's the day. Ooh, her grades are up. She's a B student. Exams are finally over. The day was grueling and the questions were fierce, but the day is finally done. Thanks to the quick work of the Scanatron Mark 7, all of the tests have been graded and the results are out. Here has, here's how everyone did. Zoe aced her exams. Hell yeah, she did. And then prom is coming, but we're... Do we have our thingy? No, we don't. Okay. Um, we do need to play some chess, though, f just to get the daily task done for it. There is a chess table in the library. No, she does think he is extremely attractive, though. He's in his wolf form. That feels a little bit like bestiality, but I'm, we're not going to touch on that, I guess. I think I'm going to save and then reload the game, and hopefully that fixes the damn lagging problem because it's so annoying. Okay, so we're back in game. Uh, hopefully the lag's fixed. Um, also, I turned the fan on because your girl's dying. What's new? Um, I'm so ready for colder weather like it's September can we just get colder weather already um I'm just gonna send her to bed because she's literally so tired I hate why isn't my time going super duper fast I know I have a cat but okay hold on ask to lie down cinnamon go to sleep it's still not going fast Okay, also, we have these to open. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to wake you up. It's the the feathers from uh, Cinnamon. She did something to get them. And we need the money. Hell yeah, we did it. We just need to do our homework one more time. Although, I don't know why it didn't count before. Oh my gosh, she's ovulating. Hello? I have the go-ahead to invite some friends over for a sleepover. Did you want to come over? Yeah, why not? Zoe's accepted the invite, but now needs to find a way there. She could ask for permission to try and leave and hope no one catches her. Clicking on the ground or an openable window. Go to the sleepover. Well, I mean, we don't have parents, so... Oh, does she just go on her own? That's kind of cool. Oh my god, not Cinnamon defeating another squirrel. I wonder how long she's, she'll be gone. This is uh, from a mod. Uh, what mod's it from? Cinnamon? Oh my god. Hi, Hasley. I don't remember what mod this is from. Not her being irritated. Okay, if she's at a sleepover, why is her energy not going up? I mean, I guess it's a teenage sleepover. Who sleeps at those, right? I kind of thought we would go with her. Cinnamon has been sprayed by a skunk. Great. Will Cinnamon clean themselves or do I have to give them a bath? I don't, I, I'm honestly not sure. Go ahead and come home. As flawless as Zoe was at leaving without permission, someone must have ratted her out. Sneaking out through a window would help Zoe avoid detection. Who's going to ground her? Caught in the act. Zoe was a little overconfident that she could leave unnoticed. I know cats are like self-cleaning, so I didn't know if I... Oh. Well, she's not stinking anymore, so I'm assuming she did it herself. We love an independent queen. Oh, good morning. Okay, here. Go ahead and change into your cold weather, because you said you were cold. Then go back to sleep. Did the cat wake you up, actually? You did. Don't be an ass. Oh, we have prom today. We definitely need to get some sleep. Do we have enough for sleep replacement? Because I don't want to just sit here while she sleeps. Go ahead. Wake up. Drink this. Cinnamon has been bitten by a squirrel. Okay, Cinnamon, can you stop? Okay, can we build... 
just a little something because I feel bad that our cat is sleeping outside. So we're going to put all the kitty cat stuff in here. And your toy. And... Oh, and your litter box. Uh, I guess the litter box can stay outside. Because, I mean, it it's fine. Alright, so let me go ahead and move this stuff. So I can move this over. Cool. And then I'll just put this right here and this right there. This is functional off the grid. It's expensive, but it's a light. Oh, we can get some more money from these. Perfect. Can we use that extra money to, whoops, oh my god, hello? And then, if we sell this. We can get just get a blow up mattress. Perfect. Your toy's right there, but I'll move it. Hell yeah. We have a little a little shack now. It is kind of bugging me that this door isn't right there, so. There we go. Perfect. We have a little shack. And neither of you have to sleep outside anymore. I'm just gonna have her, actually, we'll wait to eat because she um she can eat at prom but i am gonna have her do her homework because i really want to get that done that's the only thing we have left we have to do homework one more time we're literally just chilling at the school hey zoe we're having a little get together before prom okay where are we at kiyoshi's house no This is such a cute room. Are we at Sydney's house? Hi, Jeb. Let's go ahead and express our admiration. Why are you pissed? Oh, because of your period. Ooh, we really need to get her some pads or tampons because if she starts her period today, and she starts bleeding, like, oh, imagine. Okay, well, we can't go. Not right now, anyway. What are you doing? Chat with Kiyoshi? Okay, as long as he's not a dick. Brighten his day. Let's go ahead and do a new post. Let's do a random post. Oh, cool, it's Blink. What are you up to today, Savannah says. We're gonna be going to prom, bestie. Let's tag Jeb in a flirty message. Passing steamy looks across the room anytime I see Jeb. I need to get my flirt on. Okay, Zoe, that's cringy. Oh, she was practicing her debate. Woo! Travel to prom with Zoe. Here we go, y'all. Here we can go. I get that you want to dance, but you're not even dressed for prom. <gasps> I forgot that I gave her this. Look how beautiful she is. Oh god, she thinks someone here is ugly. Alright, so we need to eat something. She is hungry, so 
I don't know why my aunt's dog's barking, but what's new? Is there anything vegetarian safe here? This is, okay. Oh. Wait, wait. I mean, I guess we're here as friends. Aww. Well, that, actually, that's weird. I thought that was a teacher for a second. That's, that's a little weird. Okay, well, let's come over here and talk to Sydney, I guess. Our date's dancing with Darling. Sweetheart dance. Do you think Rohan will sweetheart dance with us? I kind of doubt it, but... Oh, Yuki and Sophia. <gasps> he is. He doesn't like this music, but cute. This is so cute. I don't know why this isn't counting as dancing with someone. There it goes. Thank you. And it also should count for dance, but whatever. Let's come vote for prom royalty. We could vote for Jeb, but let's vote for Rohan. Oh, the the prom award thingy is happening. Well, we just voted, so. I don't even, oh, there's Jeb. Yes, what? Are you gonna start talking? We haven't had a very good prom so far. I mean, we have, but not according to this. By the results for the winners of the prom court, I'm happy to announce the following. Prom royalty is Rohan and prom jester is Hugo. Cute. Apparently everyone likes the jester. That's cute. Okay, I'm gonna let her dance because that's one of the things we have to do. You know, it definitely should have counted when we danced with Rohan, but whatever. And then I kind of want her to show off her outfit to Jim. We just gotta find it. Show off outfit. Oh my god. And she also needs to talk to someone. Well, we'll kill two birds with one stone. Show off outfit. Let's go ahead and compliment his appearance. Tell him he looks spiffy. and flirt with him. <laughs> and I really want a photo booth picture. So let's go take a romantic photo with Jeb. We have 11 minutes, but so we got the impression that Jeb finds her quite attractive. We should be able to get this in time, and if not, he shouldn't leave right away. Hopefully. A decent night. You've earned a shiny reward. It's in your household inventory. Let's keep this party going. Want to come with for the after party? Yes, with friends. I really want to make sure that Jeb comes. And, uh, and Rohan. Where... Oh, we're at the we're at the pier. Okay, makes sense. I don't know if it's always held here, but let's go ahead. We can take our picture here instead, I guess. Let's do a bold pickup line to Jeb. She's feeling confident. And then then we can go try this again. This one never works for some reason. 
Okay, here. How about y'all go on the, like, swan ride thingy? Did he just say no? Okay. Uh, exchange numbers, even though you definitely should have each other's number. I thought he walked away to flirt with someone for a second, and I- Oh my god, she's bleeding. Oh, help! I got a, I got a good picture. Cute. Do you think he'll go on this ride with us now? <gasps> we can woohoo. Jeb. Oh, he said yes this time. Oh my god, not the music. Have fun. Also, not it's snowing in fall. Oh, Zoe wanted to make the perfect romantic atmosphere and thought the cuddle cards would be the best way. What she wasn't expecting was just how cheesy the ride would be, which isn't exactly the vibe she was going for. She looks at Jeb and tries to gauge his reaction. She can't tell if he's into the corny atmosphere or not. Does Zoe poke fun at the ride and add some flirty banter to try and make the moment a little more romantic? Or does she embrace the cheese and attempt to show Jeb a slice of playfulness? I don't think Jeb's the kind of person that takes life too seriously. So, embrace the cheesiness. Why not? Zoe has learned Jeb's romantic orientation. It's cheesy, sure, but it's adorable, and Zoe can see that Jeb is enjoying the ride. That's enough to encourage Zoe to go all in. The rest of the ride, Zoe puts on the performance of a lifetime in perfect sync with the ride's over-the-top exhibits. Jeb wipes tears from his eyes from laughter and loves that Zoe is playing along with the classic ride. This playful side of Zoe couldn't be more attractive to Jeb. The sound of... The sound of giggles from that cuddle cart puts the put the rest of the ride's lovey-dovey displays to shame. Gained romance between riders. That's cute. Romantic exploration? Yes. Okay, so he only wants romance with women, but he'll mess around with women or men. Love that for him. You did not just get fried chicken. She's like, oh shit, I forgot I'm vegetarian. Okay, you're wasting our money. Get a veggie slider. <laughs> you idiot. Alrighty, you guys. I'm gonna go into this part here. And I have decided that this will be the last part. Um, I had a lot of fun with this part, but I just feel like... For one, this save seems really laggy and it's so annoying. Um... But for two, I feel like even though we haven't gotten to graduation with her, I don't feel like that's a big deal. We did prom. We had a pretty good prom. Um, and I just feel like this is a fine place to end off on. So I I am going to go ahead and end this uh, series. But I had a lot of fun. I love Zoe. I want to put her in maybe my Carlson legacy so we can kind of see her around. Maybe she and Riley can be friends. I don't know. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this part and this series. And uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in whatever video I do next. Bye, guys.